and his name is John Cena! Actually, our names are not John Cena, but yep. still. Yeah, uh, welcome to episode 11 of fucking Dark Souls. We're souling the darks right now. Yeah, I have no idea where to go. Uh, I remember nothing. We we killed a boss. Was that the end? I think it, probably. I think it may have been, yeah. We'll find out this time. On Midgard Lost. Sure, let's, let's go down to the Pit of Hollows. I'm pretty sure there's nothing here. Maybe... Maybe a washing pole? No. How... Why would you name a katana a washing pole? That's fucked up. Ask the makers of Dark Souls 1. Like, how do you wa wash yeah, this these with a katana? This is nothing. No, this is where we killed the guy. It, it's called the washing pole because it's stupidly long, though. Ah, I see. All right, let's go up to the dilapidated bridge and do... something. Kill the bad guys. Nah. Does this game have only? Um. No. <laughs> and it's weird that it has only slayer arrows. Oh, I remember this part. You do, huh? That's good. Yeah. Sometimes remember things. Not often, but sometimes. You're almost dead. Drink. That, I think I may have had like one health. Drink a tuber. Stick a straw in the thing. There, he dead. He is. I still feel like we should be able to loot his saw and attack things with sauce. 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 Big party for my sauce. <laughs> Wait, what am I looking for? There we go. I want to... What's that for? Transforming the environment? No, what? No, it's for turning me into a pot. Oh yeah, you're you're gonna try the you're gonna try the potted technique again. Yes. Let's see if it actually works. Become the pot. Come on. Get assaulted by demons. And then become the pot. Yes. Oh shit! Whoa! That came out of nowhere! Yep. That guy throws hard. Thank you. Um. Wow! He threw the enemy to you. No, 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 no! Mother. Oh, it decarded you. Sad now. Drink tumors and leave. Tumors, now in soda form. Yeah, boy. M how? How did you? He anticipated your movement because he's pro at this game. Seems like it, yeah. Imagine a Dark Souls MMO where those spears would be some dude just like hanging out in a ball thrower or something. <laughs> and like that tree would be a dude, and the tombstones would be a dude, and like, 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 like everything would be a player. Especially that thing, whatever that was. Sully in the face. Mortician's ashes. Yep, that's what I'm here for. Is it from a mortician or did a mortician own it? I'm honestly not sure. Does that matter? Kinda do. Because, like, having one thing is much more common than the other. Like, you don't. Like, morticians don't die nearly as often as other people because you're much less of them than other people. <laughs> I suppose that that's logic of a kind. Yeah, or like I worded that super poorly. I'm aware, but yeah, <laughs> I do that sometimes. You may have noticed. I have noticed. That was not a jump. Sick jump, bro. You were supposed to do a jump. Why didn't you, you do a jump? Say it was a super relaxed jump. There Barely moved your leg upwards. A great scythe. Is it better than the okay scythe? I would assume so, since it's great. Nice. So it's endorsed by Tony the Tiger. I did not say it was great. Aww. Just it. Hey, it's hey, it's a metallic or something. It's invisible. Bit. <laughs> jumping ahead. I am not jumping down there, you lunatic. I mean, look at the blood stains. Does that kill the human? Look. Blood stains mean other players who are dead or what? Yeah. I see. 
All right. That seems like a no-go. Only... <laughs> <laughs> nice. All righty then. Uh, that was pretty amazing. That was pretty good. If only I had a woman. By the way, oh. I just want to point out now, so you guys know beforehand, if you don't share this video with at least five people before midnight, a ghost will appear and like give you diabetes. Tim is a liar. Dude, chainmail is never wrong. I've died at least six times from chainmail alone. Like from a single chainmail that is. Kept coming back to me and yeah, it was, it was weird. Just please note the fact that we're not actually talking about chain emails, we're just talking about pure chainmail. Yeah. Yeah, the armor, it like it's yeah. heavy, yo, it's hard to breathe in this. I did not think that would reach me. It did, though. It did, and and it fucking killed me. Killed me good. It did do that. I think there's a better way to get there. Yes, there is. Yeah. We need to and travel to now it. Now we know. Yep. We have, have no idea where to go. Uh, we should probably fight the enemy. Yep. Let's do that. Good thing. How do you pronounce that? The, the name of the dude who owned the Black Bowl. Farish? Farish? I'd, I'd go with an F. Farris. Farris. I, I don't Just know why I, was, why I was adding an H sound to the end. It makes no sense to add it there. I just did for some reason. I don't know. Comedic purposes. Let's go with that. Not even. It wasn't even fucking intentional. I just did it accidentally. Alright. Where's my souls? Got my souls. Delicious souls. Oh, fat woman. Dude, did you just assume the being's gender? Quit doing that. I think you've done it before, I feel like that. Yeah, it, it may actually be a dude. It, pretty sure. For now, it is a non gender identified being, and we respect its choices. Except for the choice to try to kill us. That, yeah. That's rude as fuck. That is rude as fuck. Like this is this is why I'm anti crusades or whatever kind of opinion war you want to go to because like not respecting other people's opinions if you're killing them because of them. Man's not wrong though. No rights. Like I am, I Later, am nerds. wholeheartedly anti murdering people for opinions. I know that's an unusual stance for some people, but yeah. Shouldn't. Oh, nice. Just made it there. Yep, that was on purpose. Ah, okay. Nice. Because we want to go in here. Look at you doing things intentionally and shit. I sometimes do that. You may, but I don't. I just let it happen now. Go with the flow and stuff. Ow, ow, ow. And by flow, I mean fumbling through the game and not knowing fully what I'm doing at the time. Take that, wall! The wall is dangerous. No. Like, like in ev Ding any dong, kind of adventure situation, you have to assume that everything might be a mimic, even your clothes. So, <laughs> like, run around naked and punch everything. Otherwise, you die from mimic attacks. What What about your extremities? Could they be mimics under those rules? Only if you weren't aware that you lost an arm or leg or something. But that might have happened because you might have amnesia because that's a really common plot device. It's me, Mario. Someone there. Anyone? Dude, you you called the main character Ma Mario. Mario Hellscape confirmed. <laughs> Heard it here first, folks. 2018, Mario Hellscape confirmed. Uh, that's also some Mario sequel. <laughs> Deal with it. And now I'm going to make it my mission to find Luigi. So <laughs> please. What if this is Luigi and Luigi was always a trans woman? Touch the woman. Dude. Touch her. Do you have Good boy. do you have consent yes, in three three documented so forms? Mm. Pretty sure we have it on video at least. Yeah, but that's only one form of documentation. We need we have it on audio technically too, so those <laughs> two. And if you um, want to count audio visual as a specific we, we thing. And we have subtitles, so Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, yeah, then it's okay. Yep. 
But if it would not trouble. Uh, sure. I shall I Dude, she right. had a tumor. Didn't she? You were out of tumors no. before, right? No, no, no. Oh. Oh, I thought she gave you a tumor, and I was like, nice. You just she... ripped a piece of her body mm. and just threw it at you or some shit. Another one of those unkindled, are you? You just gonna oh, you faceless now you the same shit you rescued oh, okay. the wench. How very quaint. Pitying creatures that are beyond hell. You're kinda of judgmental, <laughs> man. That sounds kinda of dickish. You bit up an asshole. But he has cool armor oh, well. and a cool weapon. So I'm sick of looking him. after her at yeah, any Can we get to murder him and take his stuff? I'm Egon. A knight of Karim. Some knight you are, man. Calling us quick for helping the poor. for as long as you assure the girl's safety. Hmm. Okay, never mind. I'm pretty sure he's just an asshole, but he has a coat of honor. Okay. What's the matter? Then we cool, bro. To you and, own and he has some kind of weird goblin demon mask thing, so... Yep. Yeah. He does that. Then I guess we're homies. And dislike the video. <laughs> Why? Because you slid down the stair? Yep, dislike for slide. Oh, I did it. Gotta keep the stupid jokes running, man. That's true, we need ongoing memes. Memes are the currency of the future. Soon you will... Soon you will come with... Come to the store with, like, a giant bag of just lolcat pictures. Because they're, they're well, one of the few memes that away. seem to, like, really... Like, most memes die fairly quickly, so they don't have any long-standing value. They fluctuate wildly, too. Kind of like Bitcoin, I guess. So, like, I wouldn't consider them a stable currency. Or, or yeah, or also, like, the... No, the Icelandic currency is stable. It's completely stable in its constant inflation. Whoa! Motherfucker. Constant inflation. That guy did a. Never mind. That I was guy... gonna say he did a cool thing, but then he killed me, which is totally uncool. Of him. He, he did a murder on me. He did a hack and murder, bro. Yep. That was unexpected and not very much appreciated. But we did get a jump. Dude, I think that was actually PewDiePie. Did you notice how he dropped down from the top left corner of the stream? Timmy. Yeah. Are you okay? Dude, have you not seen in the recent videos where he jumps out of his no. cabinet? Okay, never mind then. Then I'm just referencing shit you haven't seen. It makes no sense. Yep. Did you see that guy fall down? He didn't fall down. He tactically retreated downstairs. It's not the same. Oh, nice. Yep. See, right there, I would have tried to dodge, and I would have accidentally dodged into him and got hit. So I'm learning. And learning is the half the battle? No. GI educational professor. <laughs> That's a thing, right? Yeah, yeah, it okay. is. It is now. Yep. We will make it a thing. GI educational profession professor. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> As opposed to the non-educational professors, like. Oh, two dislikes! Come on. Ow. Dudes, the dislikes sustain us. We are fueled by the hates. We're like an emo band or some shit. Except we don't suck. Hey hey, shots fired somewhere. <laughs> At emo bands, it's like... It's the lowest hanging of fruits. <laughs> okay, rats, it's come like on. It's like literal underground fruit is what it is. So... Can somebody name me, name me an underground fr fruit in the comments? Just anybody? I don't think there's any, any viewer? fruits. Like, maybe... I, I I don't know. Does kimchi ever include fruit because they bury it in jars, right? I mean, if you're just gonna go that way, sure, we can just put like apples in a jar and bury them in the ground. Dude, all fruits that end up being trees or at some point, or naturally, I mean, or at some point, underground fruit because they decompose and become soil and new. God damn it! New give themselves nutrition. I was gonna say nutritionalize, but I guess that's not a word. Pretty sure that's not a word, no. Nutritionalize. Look at that asshole. Yeah. Just waiting to... Yeah, he did, he, he did a hack and jump. And then he did a hack and death. He did. The monster. Could this be a hole? Uh, I saw... See, there's a thing behind it. A, a white. Yep. Don't show them till you can see the whites of the rocks. Be wary of up. I should have read that shit. Yeah. Okay, no, there's not much there. Uh, 
like, um, I'm wondering how that place happens, like, where we, where we just were, like, because that does not look like a natural situation. It probably isn't, you know? Like, was What's this up, a quarry or something? Oh, this guy's cool. Got a tree coming out of his mouth. Harold, are you okay? Why he's some... terraforming. Terraforming yeah, he's... himself? No. Well, yes. And also the Earth. Dude, imagine if we could do that, though. Just, like, reform. That would be so cool. Yeah, it'd be alright. Alright, it would be fucking awesome. I'd jump out... I jump down from super high up stuff all the time. I get rid of my fear of heights right. <laughs> Just by forcing yourself to like experience death conditions. Yes. Yeah. All right. Well, because if you can reassemble thanks. yourself, it doesn't really matter. I suppose you're correct. I mean, sure, it might hurt, but then again, you get to jump from the top of giant buildings with no parachute, and that must be fun. By the way, do not do that. This kills the human. This does kill the human. Yeah. Kills, kills the human very well. I love how we give useful life tips in almost every video. I got a loincloth. I'm gonna pray to the statue of... Uh, actually What's this solution? Absolution. No, there was another thing below that. Oh, okay. Dissolution. Does that just mean being disassembled? No, th like, that's disassembly. No, but like, I don't know, I thought it meant being like mustard down or some shit. Because that sounds like something you wouldn't want. Well, uh, um, allow me to say, fuck that door. Yep. It's, a, it's such a dick, just being over there all locked and stuff. That door is a scam, it's locked on both sides. Wow. Yep. That's lame. Yep, who does that? Who just locks a door and, and is locked from both sides? Uh, Rudy, the rude, rude person. Not even an unlock mechanism, what the fuck? Yeah. Where's my key? God damn it, I feel cheated. <laughs> because locks usually have keys. Yup. That's the whole point. Otherwise you would just put a wall in there. Wait, if that's... <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna have to go to the rat place again. Oh. I get, like, disoriented real easily in places like this, so I have no idea where we're going. Up. Oh! Yep. I thought this was diagonally to the left. Sure you did. Yeah. I never tell lies, man. But is it a lie if... Like, I assume people know I'm joking when I say shit like that. Because if they don't, I'm worried for them. Me, me too. Um, I know there's a thing down here. Let's go there and get killed horribly. Sounds like fun. Yep. No wait, what's the other thing? Hor horrible, yes, I'm so yeah, horrible. There you go. Like, but then again, I haven't been killed in real life, so I don't really know. Therefore, try hole? What? I don't know. What's but the obsession with this game's player base on the word hole? Um, to leave a message, you have to select a word from a list of words. Ah, uh, kind of like in po the Pokemon games, where where they're like, yep. tell me about your player strategy, and you're like, Bulbasaur, Poison, Strong, or some dumb shit like that. Oh, it's this guy. He is fucking cool, though. He is also dead. I got him! Yes. Well, freaking dumb. Thank you. I said freaking. I don't know why. I usually swear anytime I feel like it, it just kind of happens. Heck. <laughs> <laughs> Hacking frick! There we go. Here and then try range. I did, I did it. it. If only I had a finger. What? Uh. Man, these people are high. Yep. Also, we need to like. Yeah. Need to give that guy a thumbs up. Totally. Alright, here are horrible things. I'm pretty sure we're progressing though. Oh wow, that was fucking cool. Dude, I wanna I wanna be able to do that, just like pop wings out of my back. Be so badass. They look kinda painful though. Like really. It did, but still you, like you could fly and you'd just not retract them ever. <laughs> you just find a way to live with it. Just having them out there. And you'd have wings. You you would have wings, yes. 
I remember seeing some agitation show when I was a kid though that said that for, for the rough estimate of people being able to fly, they'd have to have the chest muscles of basically an Olympic powerlifter. Yeah. The size of about a six year old. And I don't remember the wingspan size, but like imagine that person. Like a six year old with the chest muscles of a Olympic bodybuilder just sounds weird. But then again, if you check, like if you look at birds, they have hello chest muscles. They do. Like That's why we eat them. Yeah, imagine if we'd like fry people or something, chest <laughs> muscles would be pointless. We, what? I'm not saying eat people, I'm saying in the situation, I, I'm using it as a point of reference for the difference in the physiology between us and birds. Okay, but but that, that was a hell of a weird, weird example. That was just weird. Okay, if you dissect a human and compare the thickness based off of size on a human's chest muscles compared to a bird's... <laughs> it's loads better. If I you, don't know, man. If you'd fry a human... You fry birds frequently. Like, you fry chicken all the time. Or, yeah, but personally, what, what? I don't, but I buy fried chicken. Regularly, if I can. It's fucking good, man. This and kind of looks like a player or something. It's not. That sword looks hella anime, though. It does, doesn't it? Yep. It kind of... I was just about to fucking say, it kind of reminds me of Butcher's Cleaver. <laughs> that may be a reference, but I don't know. Might be. But then I get... Hey, twin daggers? Dude, we, we got... Are they just glued together or some shit? Or does it mean it's two of them? It's, it's two of them. Okay. Mm-hmm. Just like we have two of these. Oh, I thought we, I thought we just had two swords equipped, not twin swords necessarily. Also, for them to be true twin sword, swords, do they need to be made out of like one hunk of ore, or do they just need to be made, made similar? Because that not, that's not how you do true twins. That's just siblings. Heard it here first. Twins are born out of the same hunk of war. <sighs> I don't even know what to say to that. I'm sorry, <laughs> audience. He's not okay. Uh, it is the first show of the recording session. I'm still getting into gear. Yep. And I need more caffeine. What's up? Like, today's been kind of long, though. Like, I woke up at around noon, which is early for me because I'm one of those people, and I helped a friend move out a bunch of stuff from his apartment. These guys scare the crap yeah, out of me. Understandably, they spook me. And yeah, well, we, we filled the back of a van of this stuff. I'm... You got wrecked by the flying man. Yeah, I thought he'd go away after I got to this. Dude, he's using Jesus' crown as a bust. You see that? Uh, Freaking rude! Just thorns? Yeah, super no. disrespectful to the Jesus. Super disrespectful to the Jesus. Yep. Dude, it's almost Easter and I'm Icelandic. I have to be religious for a while so I get to have Easter. That's how it works, right? That's why we close stores on Easter, even though almost no one over here cares about religion that much. Or at all. There are some people. Like, an uncle of mine is fairly religious, like he jo goes oh. to church regularly and stuff. Wow, I, I didn't think there was anyone left. I know. Thing is though, like, that that guy's like real salt, salt of the earth, super nice human being, just, yeah. It's not like, he's not like judgmental religious, he's just religious. Yeah. It's like, he believes in the stuff that Jesus preached, is the thing. I believe in a thing called love. And mm -hmm. Steve, don't forget Steve. Of course, you have to believe in Steve. If you don't know what that is, it doesn't matter. <laughs> I say it does, man. Like, like if you're... How would you even get to our videos, being that they're less place, without knowing that reference? Well, like, okay, granted, we're definitely another type of less place, I yeah. guess, but still. 
It's like, I don't think anyone hasn't seen at least a few episodes from Jacksepticeye. Jacksepticeye. The guy. <laughs> Decepticist guy. Hello. Oh, hello. How do you do? I'm Anri of Astora. Unkindled like you. This is Horace, a friend and traveling companion. And you too, in search of the Lords of Cinder. Why does Horace not introduce himself? We're well along the road of sacrifices. Oh, well, because I'm not talking to him. Oh. I'm obviously talking to Anri. Ah. Home of the Undead Legion. Further yet is the Cathedral of the Deep. We seek the Cathedral, home of the Grim Aldrich. <laughs> we may go our separate ways now, but we are both seekers of laws. <laughs> Show the class. The and Grim Aldrich. Five, one may find the other I imagine country. just some long haired dude sitting in a basement drinking wine and, and making black metal. <laughs> <laughs> just like. <laughs> and stuff. <laughs> Is That's it... him. He is the black man. Is that just um, a couple of dogs in a suit, or? No, it's a black man Morpheus. He forgot how to speak. He just black man now. Yep. And we'll see you in the next one. We will. Goodbye. Yeah.